The DS1 Beholder 3-axis gimbal stabilizer combines the most advanced technology and double IMU sensors to create stable, handheld performance. Simple and lightweight, it's compatible with the DSLR cameras weighing up to 3.7 pounds. Using IMU sensors and 32-bit processor technology, the stabilizer can be operated at any angle. The five-way metal joystick offers complete multi-mode control over pan-tilt operation for incredible shots. In lock mode, the camera locks onto the subject while the joystick maintains full gesture control. In follow mode, the camera follows all hand gesture movements. The DS1 also features an inverted mode, which allows it to operate upside down. The quick-release balance plate simplifies initial balance and adjustments are easily made for lens changes. The included offset balance plate moves the quarter-inch 20 mount to five different positions to further fine-tune the camera's balance. Its three-axis gyro-stabilized brushless motors and 3 8 inch 16 tripod bottom socket mount easily provide more balancing options to most mirrorless cameras. The DS1 Beholder can also be paired with a monopod to create crank, slider, dolly, and time-lapse effects. LED lights can be attached to the stabilizer's USB port for night shooting and rechargeable lithium batteries make it easy to stay on the go. The DS1 can also charge any USB external device even if the power button is turned off. Built to last and designed to give stunning results, the DS1 is today's DSLR camera gimbal solution. Choose to be a video maker. Choose a camera. Choose the best equipment. Choose the spot. Choose the position. Choose the transition hit record, and choose what to do next. I choose not to make too many choices. I choose Star Slider. Star Slider is a motorized camera slider with modular components and a plug-and-play system that lets you create smooth camera movements. Monolight is the additional module which allows you to have rotary movements around multiple axes, panning, tilting, and rolling as you prefer. By turning a few knobs, you can couple two monolights with Star Slider and get the 3-axis motorization system. Then you only need to mount the camera on it, whichever model it is, plug in the battery, and use your smartphone with the dedicated app to take control of your shoot. flexibility into the project so you can choose the bundle that best suits you adapting the system to your specific needs each module is indeed matchable with the other giving the opportunity of limitless configurations use two monolights together mount them on star slider or use them separately for breathtaking still life shots move the camera and the subject at the same time and you'll be the only thing staying still We also tried to reduce this noise. We tried again, but unfortunately we couldn't fix our coffee machine, so we decided to develop Stealth Mode Motion, just in case you want to record live audio sessions or interviews. The motors are able to lift small payloads, average payloads, or very, very heavy payloads as well. And just in case you want to shoot camera car, Mount the magnetic feet, stick star slider on a metal surface, and drive away safely. The wireless control allows you to set the motion from unlimited distances, and you can free your imagination finding out extraordinary points of view. The Star Slider app has a user-friendly interface featuring simple manual mode control, or a more complex target point driven preset mode. Set up to five keyframes you want in your shot, and twist your camera movements out. Take a look. The same logic is applied to time-lapse mode, allowing you to move towards space and time settings in just a few clicks. At the end, you can always save and load preset movements to remake the same shot, 
or combine it with another in a different environment. It will enhance your creativity. Hello Kickstarter, my name is Josh and let me introduce you to the Ultimate Lenses. This is what it looks like and this is what you can do with it. This is how the Ultimate Lenses works. Grab any lens that you own, stretch it on with only one hand and now you can take incredible photos, videos and time lapses through glass without any reflection. You can also fit it in reverse to protect your camera from the elements, wedge it in your bag for extra protection, or use it as a lens changing pad outdoors. Okay, so that is the ultimate lens hood. Uh, I came up with the idea three years ago when I was in Japan. I was really struggling both by day, but especially by night to take photos out of windows without any of that glare or reflection. I'm launching this in two sizes, so if you're shooting on a pocket point and shoot camera, or even a moment lens on your smartphone, you're gonna want the ultimate lens hood mini. For everybody else, there's the full size ultimate lens hood. Now I'm really proud of this product and it does its job fantastically well. If you're a photographer or a filmmaker, then you need to have this in your camera bag. However, I do need your support to get this project funded. Check out the campaign below for all of the information and if there are any questions, please let me know and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. My name is Josh, this is The Ultimate Lens Hood. Thank you for watching and thank you for your support. Hi guys, my name is Josh, just landed in Iceland. I've got two days here to showcase the Ultimate Lens Hood and tell you guys everything you need to know about it. I'll see you at the first location. Okay, so that was the Ultimate Lens Hood in action. We'll cut back to me and I'll show you how that shot was done. Andy was filming me through this window here, which I'll demonstrate to you with this lens hood. I'm gonna go up to the glass, I can tilt my camera any angle I like, take my photo and remove all of that reflection. This is SwitchPod, a minimal, versatile, handheld tripod designed specifically for filming videos or taking photos on the go. Quickly switch from a handheld grip to a tripod and then back again in just seconds. It's super slim and it easily fits into your bag or just clip it on instead. SwitchPod is built to last. It's made with an aluminum alloy, not plastic, so it will hold whatever camera, lens, and accessories you put on top of it. Yet, it only weighs 11 ounces, or 315 grams. That's less than your morning mug of coffee, minus the coffee. Here's how it works. First, attach your camera with the tightening knob, or attach any ball head quick release system or phone adapter. Next, grip the handle wherever you'd like. If you need to choke up or switch hands, no problem. To set it down, just swing the legs open. Or if you wanna be fancy, try it with one hand. When you're ready to pick it back up, bring the legs back together. The tools you use to create shouldn't get in the way of you creating. That's why we created the SwitchPod. Hey there, I'm Pat Flynn. And I'm Caleb Bodrick. And as video creators, we've been frustrated by the options that are out there for putting our cameras on tripods. They're clunky and inconvenient and just kind of annoying. So we came up with the idea for SwitchPod because we knew there had to be a better way. Something that's lightweight but strong, something that's not too big or obnoxious or hard to hold, and something that's fun and quick to use. And over the past year, we've been designing, prototyping, and testing several versions of the SwitchPod. And at every stage, we've shown prototypes to several video creators, YouTubers, vloggers, filmmakers, and creators like us to get feedback and make this thing great. So we finalized version 1.0, this one right here, and we're ready to manufacture the first bigger batch. But that's where we need your help. We've invested our own money up front so far, but to launch this thing at scale and to get the tooling made to manufacture a bunch of these, that's why we're here on Kickstarter. So if you want to help bring the SwitchPod to life, pre-order yours today. Thanks again, and we're excited to see how you use it. Make the switch. Switch it up. Flip the switch. Switch gears. S switch it again. Switch it real good. <laughs> oh gosh, that's so bad. Uh, we want, we, no, we're gonna lose people. Or get people, maybe. Or infringe on copyright. Let's take that out.